Welcome back to First at Four. It is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Dr. Rachel Gendro is a breast surgical oncologist at Bryan Health. She's here today to talk about prevention and the latest treatments. Nice to have you here today, doctor. Thank you for having me. So let's talk about the importance first of getting a mammogram. Women should be doing this every year, especially over the age of 40, right? Absolutely, so we recommend starting your mammograms at age 40 and having them every year. Some women need to have those earlier if they have family history of breast cancer. Okay, uh, so talk to your doctor about that. Absolutely. Uh, genetic testing, should women do that if they have maybe a first degree relative that has breast cancer? Really, any family history of breast cancer, the, your insurance will now pay for genetic testing for any family history oh. of any type of cancer, actually. So it's, it's a, a very cousin, broad, aunt, absolutely, anybody. that can get covered. Perfect, okay, good to know that as well. Let's say you have your mammogram and it comes back and you get a letter and it says you have dense breasts. Yes. What should you do? So that is a very common letter that women will get and it can be very anxiety provoking. You know, what do we do about that? So an ultrasound is a great addition. If you have dense breast tissue, it can sometimes just see through that tissue better. We can also get MRIs approved through the insurance companies with dense breast tissue. So there are a lot of extra ways to look at the breast tissue. What's better to do first, the, the ultrasound? Or ultrasound would you first. Do that first. Mm -hmm. Okay, so talk to your doctor about that as yes. well. Okay, what is new as far as in the fight against breast cancer as far as treatments? So breast cancer can be very scary time for any woman that hears those words. And my goal is to just create a very calming, encouraging environment to really sit down and go through what does your imaging show and what does that pathology mean and what are those treatment options? So we now have several options for surgery for breast cancer. A woman can have a lumpectomy and that's just removing the cancer and then doing some radiation afterwards. Radiation's job is to decrease the recurrence risk. You can have a mastectomy, which is removal of the breast and a woman can opt to have reconstruction or not. It's their personal choice. Okay, so again, what is best in the fight against your particular type of right. cancer? Okay, and let's talk about prevention. What can women do right now to prevent getting cancer? So there are so many things that we can do ourselves and take control of. So we know that tobacco increases risk. So we say no forms of tobacco. Um, minimal alcohol, some would say no alcohol because that can increase breast cancer risk as well. Being at your ideal body weight and exercise. So we know that four to seven hours a week is a 20 to 30% drop. So wow. big drop just with getting some exercise in. And just as simple as walking. Going right? for a walk. Perfect, okay, doctor, thank you. Good advice today. Thank you. All right, and we'll be right back. 